I'm gonna go ahead and put some of this no rinse shampoo. And then I go ahead and I rub it in a little bit, just like you would on earth. Rub that in. And then I like to take my comb and comb it out through to the ends. All of the liquid that's in those packets, you know, if you are eating too fast and you get some of that liquid airborne, it's going to go everywhere. It's going to get on your crewmates. It's going to you're going to find it a week later, you know, by the by the uh, duct work or something. And so every little thing that you take for granted on Earth when all your stuff stays put is a little bit more challenging in space. So you do learn um, those things become second nature, but it does take a little bit of time to get used to. Looks like a smooth ride for the crew. Oh, we can see that. If we're going to be a spacefaring civilization, which I think uh, we certainly all want us to be, then this is the next natural step is to start seeing private citizens doing uh, more of this kind of thing. So it's, it is a very exciting time. And I would say, um, you know, that to those folks that are coming up soon, the Inspiration4 team, just really wishing them well. Most of us ex have experienced what it feels like to be on a roller coaster. And that moment when you're strapped down in the roller coaster and it kind of goes at high speed over the top of a bump and you rise up in the seat, that's what it felt like to me, but it went on for hours. And so I had this sensation that I was falling towards the ground because in fact I really was. I was just going so fast that I kept missing the earth and we've been doing that for months now. I hope and expect that the people that spent the money to go to space will be very happy they did and bring back some experiences that they that they're, can help share with the rest of us to better understand um, our existence on our wonderful planet. It's a pretty remarkable, striking feeling that first time that you realize you're, you're outside that protective cocoon that Earth provides to us and it's, uh, it uh, doesn't leave you uh, really ever.